Okay, so I got a question from uh, Mac. He writes and he says, Yo, Sparty, have you ever been in the friend zone and were you able to get out of it? I'm currently in the friend zone and I don't know what to do. Want to see if you have a relatable story piece and thank you. So, Mac, have I been in the friend zone? Yes. One time. And funny enough, I didn't even know I was in the friend zone. I didn't even realize it, right? So what ended up happening, that's funny in itself, but what ended up happening was back in 2014, maybe it was 2015, I start, I kissed this girl, I met this girl and I kissed her maybe once or twice. Yeah, big wheel, woo, right? I kissed her tw two times. And we started texting every day. And we started hanging out often. Our friend groups merged and we were hanging out often. And because we were texting every day, I thought I was hooking up with this girl. We'd hang out, everyone thought, you know, we would hang out all the time. And that was, that's just, I thought we were hooking up. And then it dawned upon me, because about four weeks went by, five weeks went by, I didn't kiss her for five weeks. And I'm like, this is weird. I haven't, we're texting every day. I haven't kissed her. Am I in the friend zone? And side note, if you ever ask yourself, am I in the friend zone? You're in the friend zone. Okay, so for me, I'm like, shit, am I in the friend zone? I gotta find out. So what ended up happening was the following weekend, I were out, our two friend groups are out, uh, that one joined friend group, and I isolate her, right? And that's what you should do when you try to hook up with someone. I isolate her, and it's just me and her, and I go in for a kiss, right? I get some fucking cheek, good old flesh, right on the cheek. I'm thinking, shit, I'm in the fucking friend zone. I cannot believe this fucking embarrassing so anyway what ended up happening is i'm not gonna fucking be the guy who's consistently pursuing this girl that doesn't want me that's just not what's gonna it's it's not gonna happen right so immediately i kind of just took away my attention i just took it away so she would text me i would just kind of be short be cold not really just how i would treat girls that i don't really like right so i wouldn't really give them much to work with my answers were less extravagant, right? And she kept saying to me, is everything okay? Is everything all right? And I'm like, yeah, no, it's fine. And there was nothing wrong. I just kind of slowly distanced myself away. That's what I did. So it came to the point where we just didn't text anymore or Snapchat or whatever. When I would see her, I would say hi to her, but I wasn't like, I wasn't friend, I wasn't friendly with her, right? I was just, you know, civil, see you out. I see you out. Hey, how's it going? How you been? How are you doing, right? Something simple like that. So anyway, point being, three or four years go by, five years maybe, and it's during COVID. And I hadn't seen her since college, right? Or maybe occasionally at random bars, but I hadn't really talked to her since college. And what ended up happening was during COVID, we got on this big Zoom call, that old friend group that we used to all hang out with. And it was some girl's birthday. We're all saying, hi, happy birthday. And I make my appearance, hey, happy birthday. Hope you're doing well, blah, 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 right? And what ends up happening was I say, hey, guys, I got to go. I'm, I'm meeting this girl. Um, we're going to go hang out and drink some wine in her bedroom because that's all you could do during COVID. And I shut the laptop and that was that. I kind of go, go in my car and drive off. What ended up happening while I'm driving, I get a bing and I look down. Probably 30 seconds later, it was the girl who friend zoned me and said, is the girl that you're seeing me? Is the girl you're seeing me? And I said, no, I'm out of your league. No, I'm, I'm going to see someone better looking than you, right? I'm fucking with her. And that's how I used to be with her. I would fuck with her. Um, and she's like, well, you should cancel that date and come see me, right? And I said, oh, that's, that's an interesting offer. Why don't you come see me, right? And, you know, I didn't see her that night. But what ended up happening was down the line, a couple days later, she came, came, drove down, saw me, and we got physical, right? But point being is I wasn't continuing the friendship with her, right? If you want to break the friend zone, you got to cut the friendship off and redefine what it is. It's almost like a fucking bad relationship, a bad toxic relationship, right? You're in this relationship and it doesn't work out and you fuck up. It's over, right? What That's what you have to do with the friend zone. In the friend zone, you got to cut that friendship off. It's over. You're no longer friends. As soon as you find that out, bye. Okay, because the more you stick around, the more you talk to her, the less of a chance you're gonna get with her, right? So the minute you find out, shit, I'm in the friend zone, back the fuck off, okay? Back the fuck off, cut it off, okay? And what happens is she will naturally, the natural string of events 
is there something wrong? You're not answering as much. And you just gotta push through it. Yeah, everything's fine, right? And you just slowly bah, 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 pull away, okay? Now, what needs to happen, this is the most important thing, okay? Every guy I've coached that has gotten out of the friend zone, the most important thing is she needs to see you getting physical with someone else. Okay, she needs to hear about it. She needs to see it. She needs to see it firsthand. Because the reason, okay, the reason that she is not being physical with you is because she, you are not showing her that you're a man. You're not showing her that you have masculine energy. Okay, she needs to see another girl getting that from you because the image of you is a pussy, a little fucking bitch. So you need to show her in a sense that you don't need her and other girls want you. Okay? And when she sees that, in my case, center point, in which, I, I, again, shocked I was in the friend zone. I was totally shocked. I never thought that would happen to me, right? But in that case, when she saw me getting with someone else, that made her want to be with me, okay? So that's what you need to do. Now, don't go out of nowhere and just say, oh, this girl's texting me, uh, and then continue, like, communicating with her all the time. No. She needs to see it almost as a second-hand view, okay? A second-hand view, a fly on the wall who sees it. So, like, let's just say you were in college, and she sees you out, and she sees your arm around another girl. She's going to get turned on by that because she's like, okay, that's a, that's a fucking man. He do, maybe he does have it, and maybe I misjudged him, right? And you're not texting her all the time. You've kind of re-identified your image with her. You're no longer that beta little bitch who kind of wants her so fucking badly, but she can get you, pick you up whenever you want. No, you're you now within your own power. And that's what she needs to see. A man within his own power. Now, this time around, go for it, though. You gotta go for a move. Don't be hesitant to back off. Go for it. That's the only way to fucking go about it. You go for a move, right? Let her see you getting physical with other people. Stop being her friend. And that's it. Those two things. That's it. And that re re reminder, the only reason she's friend zoned with you is because she had initial attraction to you, right? That's why she's friends with you. She had initial attraction with you. But then at some point you turned her off to the point she didn't want to be a friend. She didn't want, she didn't see you as a sexual partner anymore. Okay, you did something. Probably didn't pull a move when the opportunity was there, and she's like, well, this is a weak man. I don't want to date him. Okay? So she, you just got to re-identify that image of you. Peace.